All right, so this is my Core Ultra 5 245K system that I'm trying to overclock currently. And I do have um, an overclock kind of dialed in. Let me go into the BIOS here and see. That's the that's a little cat here. Um, so I'll go into the BIOS and show you kind of the setup that I'm working with here. Um, you can see that I've already just enabled XMP, got up to 5.6 gigahertz on some of the cores, the P cores that is, then 4.9 gigahertz on the E cores. And then I've already been able to dial in the memory subsystem as well, which includes the, the ring, the NGU and the D2D. And then what I'm trying to work out now is I'm trying to figure out how to do, um, let's say, per core adaptive voltage. So the way that this should work is that for P core zero, it should set 1.35 volt at 55x and then um, interpolates to 52x, which is the, the maximum default ratio. Um, so that's what I've been trying to do. Um, but the Arrow Lake is, even though it's it's already came out quite a quite a while ago, it's still a little bit hard to, you know, to get all the settings to work like you want them to work, especially for kind of a dynamic overclock, which which I'm trying to do here. So I'm not trying to just set a fixed ratio and a fixed voltage. I'm really trying to get the ratios to go up and down dynamically, and the voltage then go up and down accordingly as well. Um, so this is what I kind of want to show you. I set everything to 1.35 volt, and you know everything should be boosting to uh, 1.35 volt. But then if I go and have a look in hardware info, okay, let's open this here. Yeah, then you can see that. Um, so here, the P0 and P1 cores are doing 1.35 approximately. That's fine. But then P cores 10 and 11 go to 1.4, and then P cores 12 and 13 only have like 1.23 volts. So not exactly what I configured. And that's just one of the things that I, I'm gonna try and figure out like how I can configure the P core ratio and then try to figure out what's the maximum ratio when I also use overclocking thermal velocity boost. Anyway, that's it. See you next time.